Hello everyone. In today's video, we will discuss about one of the most common interview question asked horizontal versus vertical application scaling. So let's learn about what is scaling of applications. So in e-commerce or any of the applications which is high volume of traffic, it is very important that application scales automatically with the changing need. For an example, a big take e-commerce website during their sales time or during festival times the traffic on their servers and applications will increase drastically so the applications and servers should be capable enough to cope up with the increasing traffic that is called scaling of applications so if we say in simple words application scalability refers to an application's ability to handle increasing amount of load users, data, or other resources without experiencing a significant decrease in performance or reliability. So there are two kinds of scaling. One is vertical scaling, which is also called scale up and horizontal scaling, which is called scale out. So let's see what is vertical scaling, scale up. Vertical scaling involves increasing the capacity of a single machine by adding more resources such as memory storage or processing power if we see in the diagram we have a single server but during scaling up of the server we are adding more cpu ram and storage to the same server so single server we are adding more power and ram and disk there are some of the disadvantages or limitations of vertical scaling Vertical scaling has hard limit. It is impossible to add unlimited CPU and memory to a single server. Vertical scaling does not have failover and redundancy. If one server goes down, the website app goes down with it completely. To overcome these limitations, there is another kind of scaling which is called horizontal scaling and scale out. When traffic is low, vertical scaling is great option and simplicity of vertical scaling is its main advantage. But when we have large applications, then horizontal scaling is more desirable. Horizontal scaling also known as scaling out involves adding more instances of the same type to the existing pool of resources to handle increased traffic and load. Unlike vertical scaling, which increases the capacity of single machine, horizontal scaling distributes the load across multiple machines, enhancing the overall system performance and reliability. In this diagram, we can see that in horizontal scaling, we are adding same type of more servers to the pool. When the request comes from the user, the request will be routed to any of the servers via a load balancer and traffic will be evenly distributed in case of any one of the servers is down due to some issue, load balancer will automatically take out that server and request will be routed to the rest of the servers and traffic and users will not be impacted. While in vertical scaling, since there is only one server, there will be an outage and application will be impacted. This is the advantage of horizontal scaling over vertical scaling and it is more desirable when we have applications which are handling large volume of users like in e-commerce or online streaming applications like Netflix. That's it in today's video. Hope you could understand the difference between application vertical scaling and horizontal scaling. Thanks for watching the video. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you.